Good Monday morning and welcome back to the Monday Market Update here in Hunt County, Texas. I am your host, Ashley Hammonds, and I hope you guys had a wonderful Mother's Day yesterday. So today we're gonna go over the numbers in Hunt County with real estate sales, pending, uh, new listings, and everything. So let's start off with how many active homes there are on the market. Right now, there's 196 homes currently active on the market available for buyers to look at. Last week, we had 46 homes come on the market, 28 sold and 16 pending. If you see on your screen, right below those numbers are last week's numbers. So we had 38 listed the week before. So we are quite a bit, quite more, quite a bit more homes came on the market last week. We had more sold the week before and we had more go pending the week before. Our our average total price of property sold in Hunt County here was 397,668. Now that's the average, some were higher, some were lower. That's just right there in the middle there. Now the total sold was 11,134,690. That is a big number again. Just like last week, you can see that number uh, the week before last week. You can see what the number was last Monday market update 11,546,393. So we were a little bit lower than that, but this is really, really high. Um, we normally average anywhere from five to seven million. Sometimes we're up, sometimes we're down. But the last two weeks, 11 million, that's over $2 million of real estate sold in Hunt County a day. Now that's business days, so title companies are only open Monday through Friday. So the title companies are closing a little bit over 2 million a day in our local Hunt County. I can't believe it. So we're gonna go to our first home on the market. This is a new home that was listed just a few days ago. It is 6407 Stonewall Street in Greenville. They are asking 259,900. It's a three bedroom, two bath, 1,610 square feet on just about a quarter of an acre. This one has been on the market for five days and let's go inside and take a look. Here is your kitchen with the new stainless steel appliances, granite countertop, LVP flooring, and the nice white cabinets. Now this home is newly rehabbed. You would be the first one in this home after rehab. And you can tell it's very, very pretty. Modern updates, uh, the stainless steel pools that match the stainless steel appliances, gray tone flooring, gray tone walls, very, very, normal right now and then you go into that uh, bathroom you don't normally see those hex tiles on the wall but i absolutely love it it's so different but at the same time it's so elegant and beautiful um, again they're bringing in that white cabinetry from the kitchen into the bathroom there and you have a different modern kind of mirror there very very pretty and here is the backyard. Um, you got a nice green grass, privacy fence. You can see it's a brick home that has been painted. And I am so sorry. Uh, and it has just been updated, like I said before. Now again, this is 6407 Stonewall Street in Greenville. They are asking 259,000 and it's only been on the market five days. So I imagine at that price point being moving ready, updated, beautiful, that one probably won't last very long. Our next one, we're going over to Colorado Street in Greenville, 6004 Colorado Street in Greenville, 320,000. This one is 1,633 square feet, built in 2019. So you're getting a newer home here, um, only about three years old, and it's a three bedroom, two bath. Let's go inside here, and you got the wood look tile and again, you kind of got that gray tone that is very in right now. Granite countertops, white cabinetry. And looking here, you can see the living room actually has really high vaulted ceilings and it kind of comes down into the kitchen and you see the pendant lighting. Um, very, very pretty here. Here is the bathroom. Again, granite countertops, everything flows together. Same flooring throughout the living space and the bathrooms. This one actually has carpet in the bedrooms. You still have the matching granite countertops. I love the walk-in shower here with the tile surround. 
And here is the back. You have a nice porch there with completely privacy fenced all the way around. Again, this is 6004 Colorado Street. They're asking 323,000 on that one. And our last active will be 2308 Watch Hill Drive here in Greenville. This is another rehab property. Um, you see that actually pretty often right now. A lot of investors in the market are purchasing the dated older homes and bringing them up, bringing life into them. And they're doing. most of them are doing a really good job. 2308 Watch Hill Drive, they are asking 329,000. This one is 2,148 square feet. That one's significantly bigger than the last two that we talked about in the same price range. So, um, it, I mean, you're looking at a, a deal here. Four bedrooms, two baths, and it's on 0 0.32 acres, so over a quarter of an acre. Here we go inside, again, just like the last two, you have the gray toned throughout, white cabinets. Uh, I didn't mean it, but there's obviously a trend here. <laughs> um, you have that nice, beautiful fireplace that has been painted to match the outside. And if you look through those doors there, you have, you have doors on each side of that fireplace. But if you look through the one on the one side, you get a little peekaboo there of a pool. Here is the bath, one of the bathrooms, granite countertops, new tile surround, love the accent and the little shelf in there. Sometimes you don't get those shelves um, in, in flips because it costs a little extra and people don't think about it, but I love that they put the shelf in there and it matches the tile all the way around. Very, very cute. Here is that pool that I was just talking about and you still have so much room on this lot that you have the grass on one side, you still have a yard you can put in a swing set. You have this nice, beautiful covered porch on those rainy days or those really hot days and you need the sun. And then you have the pool there, nice, beautiful, sparkling blue with a privacy fence all the way around this property. And here is the other angle of the backyard with the pool. So you see the pool, you see the green grass, and you see that porch that we were just standing under in that last picture. Um, it looks like there might be a new roof on that. Uh, brick has been painted with uh, like a whitish gray and the black or dark trim, which is, which is very in right now. And again, that's 2308 Watch Hill Drive in Greenville. We're gonna go over to our solds. We have three solds. Now, you saw earlier that we have more than three solds, of course. These are just a few that I had picked out. This one, 532 Brook Street here in Greenville. This one was on the market six days and sold well over asking price. We have been seeing a lot of well over asking price um, sales lately. Um, these next two, I believe, are not in that they don't have the over asking price, surprisingly. So this is 7587 Caddo Creek Road in Quinlan. This was a three bedroom, two bath on almost two acres. It was on the market for five days and the buyer's agent was able to negotiate an under asking price contract on that house. Congratulations to that buyer and seller. And our last one, this one is 554 Country Oaks in Greenville. This was 3,114 square feet. Big home, four bedroom, four bath on 11.3 acres. So lots, I mean, it, it's on Country Oaks. It's obviously in the country with 11 acres. Very beautiful home. This home was on the market for 50 days, five zero. And it also sold under asking price. So congratulations to that buyer's agents to be able to negotiate an under asking price sale on that. And that is all that we have for today. If you want to be a sponsor of the show, if you want to come visit, though we're only doing one, about, probably about one visitor a month um, so that we don't have such long shows so that you guys are able to get all your information in at once, um, give Casey Ralston a call or an email. Her information is up on your screen. And that is going to be it for today's Monday Market Update. So I hope you guys have a wonderful week and tune in next Monday. At Money Law Firm, we are dedicated and focused on being professional, personal, and proactive. 
In the title business, there's a lot of paperwork, but when you walk in the door, you don't see that. You see clean, clear walls. You see very straight lines. Everyone here is like family. They, they have a great team of people. Um, the communication is great. Um, I send as much business as I possibly can down here because they take such great care of us. Family is very important to us and that's why we wanted to bring family to our business. We tell folks that at Home Texas Real Estate, we work as a team and we're all working together to try to sell your house or we're all working together to help you find the right one that you want to buy. With At Home Texas Real Estate, it's our family helping your family.